at the NFL rookie shoot with Malcolm Kelly. You ever collect cards as a kid? Uh, yeah, I collected cards as a kid. You know, uh, I was only collecting them maybe for a year or so, you know, but I, I did as a kid for a little while. Any favorite player that you remember you collected in the day? Uh, Michael Irvin and Michael Jordan. Yeah, I know. I hear you're a big Michael Irvin fan. How would you say your styles can trust? Uh, you know, I mean, you know, he's a big guy, you know, who goes and gets the ball, you know, goes across the middle and catches the ball. Uh, catches everything around him you know he you know he, he brings it to the dbs he let the, he doesn't let the dbs bring it to him and what do you think about card collecting as a hobby for kids uh i mean you know it's something you know that they look forward to doing you know uh it's a way of you know becoming closer with the guys that they're looking up to you know what i'm saying and stuff like that so once they get those cards and save them you know it's kind of like having our own little football team you know so you know by the time it's all said and done you're going to wind up having hundreds of cards do you think about what your image looks like on the card like what do you want to see yourself doing on the card do you think about that at all uh no not really i want to see myself i don't know some one hand catches or something some crazy like that you know that's that'll be probably the most exciting thing for me to see on there and as a little kid when you first started playing ball did you ever think about being on a Topps card as a kid, or was it just so far removed, or was that always a dream? Uh, it was a dream, you know what I'm saying, but it, it seemed like it was just so far away, you know, as a kid, you know, but, uh, I mean, you thought about it, you know, but it's almost like, man, I'm only seven, eight years old, you know, and those guys are grown men, so kind of don't pay too much attention to it. You know, this is obviously an outstanding rookie class. Any guys out here you're looking to collect? Uh, oh, yeah, you know, I mean, I give him a Jake, I mean, uh, yeah, I'm a Jake Long, you know, uh, give him a McFadden in, you know, I get, you know, a lot of the guys in, you know, so. You know, now, now you're on an NFL trading card, what's going to happen is a lot of, a lot of kids are going to be hunting you down for your autograph. What do you think about that? Yeah, I mean, that's cool. Uh, back at Oklahoma, you know, you kind of get used to it down there, you know, so uh, it's good, man. Like I said, you were once one of those little kids asking people for autographs, so, you know, it's good to give back. Anything in particular you had a good time doing today? And yesterday, I know the past couple days, you've been taking lots and lots of pictures. Yeah. Anything special about today that's been fun? Uh, today, you know, well, all I've did really just sign cards, you know, and uh, just did an interview, you know, or so. But uh, we'll get to go catch some balls in a minute, you know, so that's what I enjoy doing. So that'll probably be the most fun part about today. Beautiful. Congratulations to make it NFL. Appreciate it, man. Cool. Appreciate it. Now that you're Red, watching your Redskins, got a huge following. Who do you look forward to playing with? Uh, probably Devin, probably the other guy I came in with. <laughs> <laughs> Other guy came in with probably, you know, so just because, you know, uh, both two young guys, you know what I'm saying, I just want to see what we'll be able to do, you know, so we can push each other the most and stuff like that. You did not want to see on the opposite side of the ball for you. Warren Landry. Why is that? He is a headhunter, man. You guys are the same team, so I can see a game situation. Oh, game situation. Who I don't want to see. Uh, I don't know if I want to come across the middle and see Ray Lewis in the middle. I don't know how. Yeah, with open arms. Yeah, I know it. I know he would. Nice. Who's your favorite player growing up? Uh, Michael Irvin. You bought a lot of your game after him? Uh, yeah, yeah. I try to. Try to. Who, who, who really inspired you growing up to play football? Um. Really, probably, probably him. I mean, from the age I was five or six years old, man, just, you know, watching him on TV and stuff like that, man. So, yeah, probably him. Probably my guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, man. Oh, yeah. Do you have a favorite superhero? Uh, favorite superhero? Superman. You got a speed? Nah, not no Superman speed. I'm, I'm, Dexter might be the only person out here with a uh, Superman speed, you know, so. Play a lot of uh, video games? Yeah, yeah. Looking forward to playing yourself in the new football game? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. That'll be cool. That'll be cool to see how it is, you know, so it'll be fun. What are your, your goals for this year? Uh, well, you know, so I want to come in, you know, and have an impact more than anything, you know. Um, contribute as much as I can. Do it, you know, be a, especially a red zone threat. You know, they're looking for one of those, you know, if they're in the offense and uh, just be a part of the offense, the new West Coast offense that he's bringing in. Have you, uh, what do you think about the speed so far of the game compared to the college level? You know, it's it's a little faster. You know, it's, it's not that much faster. You know, but all those guys study so much, man. That technique is is down to a T. You know, so that's really the biggest adjustment. You know, is how how technique wise is the biggest adjustment.